A coat of paint can completely transform a room, changing the way it looks and feels as well as the way you feel. So it's fair to say it requires some serious thought. Not only do you need to consider your colour, but also everything about it. The mood it evokes, how it reacts to the light in your room, how it plays with other colours you want to incorporate. With the right knowledge, you can easily upgrade your home with paint. When it comes to colour scheme, there are a few things to think about on top of just pondering the type of atmosphere you actually want to create. What's the style of the room and will this affect the colour you decide on? Which direction does the room face? Think about the way in which natural light comes into the room and how it moves across throughout the day. East facing rooms tend to let in warm morning light that gets colder during the day, while west facing rooms are the opposite. What about furniture or other decorative items? Is there anything you want to keep in the room that could influence your choices? If it's your bedroom, which is a room that you mostly use in the evening, it's a lot more suited to dark colours than something like your living room, which you'll probably want to keep light and airy. As well as light and dark shades affecting our mood and setting the tone of a room, specific colours can also have an effect. Yellow, for example, when used sparingly, can evoke feelings of joy and happiness in your home, whereas a nice tranquil shade of light blue can naturally be quite cooling and calming. Opting for green can help with stress relief by resonating with feelings of nature in the outdoors. Bold colours and patterns result in maximum impact, but overusing them can end up feeling a bit overwhelming. You don't want them competing with each other, so balance them out with neutral tones where you can. If you go neutral on your walls, you'll have much more room to play with when it comes to decorating your room with bold, colourful highlights like lamps, blankets, pillows, artwork and much more. It might seem like a big step to take, but opting for dark colours adds a lot of personality to your room where white or light tones just don't. If you're going to do it, it's good to commit and paint all four walls as opposed to painting just one or settling on a mid-shade instead. If you fancy a dark neutral, throw in some accenting colours. You'll be surprised at how many colours complement dark shades of grey, navy, black and brown. A sense of cohesion throughout your home is really important. Each room can look and feel unique and distinctive when it comes to style and theme, but try and tie them together by maintaining continuity in some way. Otherwise, things might end up feeling disjointed. To do this, use complementary colours where rooms connect and you won't need to worry about things looking out of place. 